Hey programmers, today we're going to create a context menu strip and, and assign it to um, this data grid view. And um, I've already deleted the add button and I've deleted, well, I'm going to delete it now. Delete, I'm going to delete this delete button. I already deleted the code behind the delete button. And um, anyway, so first thing we do, oh, and before I actually deleted those, I took the code that was behind them and I created me two methods. One's called add seg and it was the exact code that was behind that add button and one was called delete seg and it was the exact code that was behind that delete button and I'd already created this tool menu once and had problems so <laughs> I deleted it and we're going to redo it. Anyway, so we take we just take the context direct menu and we pull it down here at the tray and creates it. And it pulls up here and we are adding stuff. A D D and delete. It's kind of slow. It's been kind of slow. E delete. Now we'll come back here to the add and we're gonna create a shortcut T of control. A, and we're going to come here to the delete, and we're going to create another shortcut key. Oh, wrong one. Control D. Okay. Then we click the add again. We're going to come to the events, and we're going to double click that, which it's already got. Well, now click. I thought we had that one. Did we delete it? Um, we're just going to delete these here. Delete, because that was from the... So, add tool strip. Hmm. Oh, we're going to delete that too. Now then, um, let's go back to the designer, and we're going to back to the just hours, and I forgot to do something. We have got to this, we've got to associate it with that context. Go back, delete, click, and we've got that. And for this one, we're going to make it do that, what we created. And for this one, we're going to make them do the delete. Okay. I hope this will compile since I said it did. These are some I already created, so if I say right click here, let's say add, it should create a number five. It did. Now then, um, let's refresh this. Okay, now we're going to delete out number three. We're going to delete him, and we're going to say right click, delete. Or she went yes, and so it should get out number three. So one, four, five. Okay, it did. So what we're going to do is eventually we're going to get rid of this box here at the bottom and we're going to do our editing on the grid line, but I've got to work on that before we do it. And so that's going to be all today and you guys work on that. Bye.